There are so many beautiful things in life that you can see when you only lower yourself. Like the purest eyes of children, an old man's wrinkles on street, and sweet elysium flowers on the grass. That's how I enjoy my adventure on foot in exotic places. It's my first official day off and weekend since I landed in Tanzania, and I plan on recharging and spending quality time with my friends Lisa and Ceci in Dar es Salaam. This is a room. Just checked in. I'll be working. And they have a free Wi Fi. Oh my god, what a luxurious space. And the ocean. Yeah, I'm gonna jump into the swimming. Easy access to the internet, clean water pouring from every faucet, shampoo and toiletries feel incredibly privileged and abundant. My life has dramatically shifted from surviving with a basket of water for a week to this luxury of a glass of wine, burger, and fancy rooms. I'll be staying at Sassy's for a few days too. She's a small business owner and a fierce woman friend. Few days. Okay. Cheers. It's a great reminder of how much infrastructure is developed unequally across the country and globally. Back to work. My second project is a bit more intense as we'll meet over 150 women and girls in town with my dream team, the New Hope New Winners Foundation and Sayutiam Toto. Skola is four months pregnant with her second baby and it's inspiring to see how she manages all this physically while carrying a heavy load. Hello Skola, enjoy! <laughs> We're doing quick shopping, grocery shopping. Here's another nest I'll be staying in the African Human Rights Network office. They have a spacious facility and shelter city where they offer counseling, retreats, and training for human rights activists, asylum seekers, and refugees. It's their off-season, so I am the only guest in this entire building. We go up or later? Yes. Okay. Oh, I have a key. Yes. Mm -hmm. Thank you everyone for setting up the room. Hello. <laughs> and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Even me, bye. No, Skola, Skola, you're gonna be here with me. <laughs> it's a game day. We expect about 50 women for each session, two consecutive days back to back. The majority of participants are over 40 years old today. We don't know the actual demographics of the participants until they show up, so I now decide to facilitate topics centered more on community leadership for the elderly. Of course, we practice meditation together too. 
mwaji wako na katika pua yako. These ladies are very vocal and not shy about speaking up on issues. Issues on finance, marriage, relationships, domestic violence, and poverty. And they also emphasize and heavily encourage women's education, knowing that knowledge is power. Paying attention in a foreign language for hours is not an easy job. But we are doing pretty well so far, and I pour my energy into breaking this language barrier through non-verbal communication and my overall vibes. There are lots of handshakes as well. And with a special guest, Tarimba Gualam Abbas, the Kinundini Municipality Member of Parliament, shows appreciation for me and my initiative with Goodly. We also hand out and share gifts, kitenge, the African fabric, pineapples, and snacks for all participants. Can you speak in Nyamala? Mwana nyamala. Mwana nyamada. Yes. Mwana Asana, ano. Habari. Asibui. 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 Tunabari asibui. Chai. Yes. Okay. Was it good? Yes. Sorry, Mandazi. You got milk? Yes. Chai. Chapati. What was this again? Mitungua. Mitungua. Samosa. Mitungua. Samosa. And that's and that. And there are lots of unexpected babies and toddlers. Day 3 is for young women under 35. These young women are mostly mothers who have to take care of their kids all day alone. We focus on self-care practices for these young mothers as well, and interesting enough, they share open up about their stress from love relationships. I heard a lot of uh, uh, men are cheating on women in Tanzania. I don't think we can control that, so let that be. Rather, use your energy to build yourself. So 
So we'll give you one each, okay? And then... This afternoon, Ceci's team invites me for an interview and a fun dinner. Hello, team! Hi! Hi King Market ladies! Asantani! The night complete with a crash course in Gen Z TikTok dance challenges. The absence of essential elements in our lives always brings appreciation for all these little things we take for granted. A clean bed, food on the table, friends and community. I feel beyond grateful again having been able to meet these people and explore this beautiful land.